a musical showdown like no other. Foo Fighters' Dave Grohl takes a jab at Taylor Swift, sparking a fan frenzy. But who really has the most fans and biggest claim to fame? Stay tuned to find out. Curious about the clash between rock legend Dave Grohl and pop queen Taylor Swift? Stick around as we dive into the drama, compare their fan bases, and see who truly dominates the music scene. Taylor Swift's era's tour has been the talk of the global music scene, breaking records and filling stadiums. However, Foo Fighters frontman Dave Grohl recently made a pointed comment, suggesting Swift doesn't sing live throughout her shows. At a recent concert, Grohl quipped that the Foo Fighters' errors tour had more than a few F asterisk 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 ING errors because they actually play live. Despite Grohl's jest, Swift subtly fired back during her Wembley Stadium concert, emphasizing her band's live performance. Grohl and Swift are both musical powerhouses, but their paths to fame have been different. Foo Fighters, formed in 1994, have sold over 30 million records and completed 10 worldwide tours. In contrast, Swift, who started her career in 2008 at just 16, has amassed a net worth of $1.3 billion, making her the richest musician in the world. With 12 number one hits, Swift has a slight edge over Foo Fighters 11. When it comes to fan bases, Swifties outnumber Foo Fighters fans significantly. Taylor boasts over 100 million monthly listeners and 284 million Instagram followers, compared to Foo Fighters' 22.7 million listeners and 5.6 million followers. The pop star's massive following is a testament to her wide-reaching influence and popularity. Grohl's comments have ignited a storm online. Swifties were quick to defend their idol, accusing Grohl of using Swift's name for publicity. Foo Fighters fans, however, applauded Grohl's remarks, seeing it as a call for authentic live performances. Despite the online clash, both fan bases remain loyal and passionate. Despite the recent tension, Grohl and Swift have previously shared mutual respect. Grohl praised Swift for re-recording her albums to gain ownership of her master recordings and once credited her with saving him during a performance at a Paul McCartney party. This history of camaraderie adds a layer of complexity to their current rivalry. Swift's third sold-out night at Wembley Stadium featured a surprise appearance by her boyfriend, NFL star Travis Kelsey. The couple's onstage chemistry sent fans into a frenzy, adding yet another unforgettable moment to her era's tour. As Swift continues her tour, she remains unfazed by the controversy, focusing on her performances and connecting with her fans. There you have it, the latest chapter in the musical saga of Dave Grohl and Taylor Swift. What do you think of Grohl's comments and Swift's response? Share your thoughts in the comments below, and if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and hit that notification bell for more exclusive celebrity updates. Thanks for watching Celeb Alert!